I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna make you better. That's what I do. You know, as you know, I have ME, you know, which is the energy deficiency disorder. And a couple of weeks ago, I had an infection, so I got some balance issues. And this morning, when I woke up, oh boy, I had some balance issues still. Don't know why. It's just what it is. That's enough about me. So, when you're waking up and you have these kind of issues, and then you find that someone posted in the group that they went to the range, they had trackman, and they hit five shots with my grip, with a wedge, and then hit five shots with a modern golf grip, with interlock. And his results was that my grip, I had 100% better dispersion rate. So you're 100% more accurate with my grip than a modern golf grip. Now, normally I don't talk about that because this is just one sample. You know, if you do science, uh, what you want to do is to have a lot of samples, right? Because one of the things with science is that, one, it's observation, right? Then it's also, if you do an experiment or observe something in nature that you want to confirm that your experiment or observation of the nature, whatever is going on, black holes or, you know, that you want to make sure it's actually accurate, right? So you do replication, you know, if you do an experiment, you tell other people, this is how we did the experiment, you can test it yourself. And if they can repeat the results, then that's a pretty good conjecture, right? That whatever is going on seems to be accurate, right? So my grip can offer you 100% better dispersion than you have today. To be more accurate, 100% more accurate. Wow. Imagine that Anne Van Dam was sitting here watching me talk about this, or Lydia Cole, because both of them and Sean Foley for some reason, right? And Anne Van Dam would hear, I can have 100% better dispersion listening to what you're talking about, yes. And, but you know, then you have people coming to my channel who are assholes. They may not even understand they're assholes because, one, they didn't do the work, one, they didn't shift my grip with, you know, thicker grip and experiment with it until they got it, you know, Suits so their hands and all that stuff, and they did work on that for a few weeks. That's what you have to do. Did you do that? Search. Of course not. I had another guy a few weeks ago that tried my grip with a modern golf club. It doesn't work with a modern golf club because it's too thin. So, yeah. And I think it's funny when, you know. This is just one member, and I would bet if other members do some similar test, they would find that their accuracy is probably 100%. It wouldn't surprise me. Most people don't understand that my, my instruction, my mechanics that I've been developing here, allows you to play golf like Moon Norman did once upon a day. But the difference here is that you're going to be longer, and it's going to be easier than what Moon Norman did because he didn't know the secret to golf. I know the secret to golf. Because I can sequence your body so it works, and you can look at Hans. He is the only one in the whole golf world, in the golf history, that's 400 years, who actually swings properly. No one else is able to do that. Mike Austin couldn't, Lee Como can't, Tiger Woods, absolutely not. Ben Hogan, no. You can take anyone and they can swing like Hans does. So mechanically, he's you know superior. He has better accuracy. And if you're a two pro, and this is what a lot of two pros you know does know. My grip allows you better accuracy, right? But it also offers you better distance control. And uh, Lee Como and C Motion doesn't know that. And then Mike Olsen Train doesn't know that. Todd Grace doesn't know that in, you know, or anyone else on YouTube or elsewhere, or golf forums and such. They don't know this because they can't teach you that. The modern golf grip, allow, you know, what it allows you to do is to get, make a golf more difficult, hit more wild, less accuracy, less distance, less control, less fun. It's just bullshit, right? 
and you know they teach you to sweep in the modern golf grip in the modern golf swing. they teach you to sweep with that grip that means that you can never feel the release and if you can't feel the release you can never really improve properly because you don't have the feedback you need they can't teach you the release of the club belt because you can never feel it the member that did this test he said yeah, it's so obvious with your grip versus this other shit that people teach us in golf now you don't need to take my word. I pat myself on the back because I created two things that's revolutionary for golfers and then I get assholes coming to my channel and you know trying to waste my time and you know you're not my audience go to some other channel and bother them with their secrets you know and they come, they're gonna teach you shit I already know that I'm teaching you what works and the good thing is I'm gonna post a video today that's short because when you have illness as I have energy deficiency I don't want to talk a lot and even though talking is easier for me than you know typing and such but it still takes a toll on me, especially when you wake up, there's more of a balance, you say, I don't want to spend a lot of time, you know, explaining myself or something, because I don't need to. I already have the information that what I'm teaching is the best golf instruction in the world. So, I think you should pay attention. And if you know Anne Van Damme or Lydia Kaur or any other two pro, send them my way, because I can send them to Hans, and they can talk to Hans, and he will convince them because he can do things they can't no matter who, whatever two pro it is he can do things they can't for a two pro that's pretty important